Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Molt. So happy to be here with you guys. We are playing on the Town Hall 7, the No Walls account, and I'm having a blast. I've got my barracks boosted. We're crushing it with Barch, like literally crushing it with Barch right now. I'm going to go ahead and uh, jump into some reviews, and then we should be able to uh, knock a couple things out at the end of this. We've got three builders available right now, guys, because uh, our barrack finally finished. And then all we've got left to finish is this in 22 hours. So that's got to be done in 22 hours. Can we upgrade this again? No. All right, so that's fully maxed out. All of our barracks, guys, are fully maxed out as well. Our army camps, level 6, level 6, level 6, and level 6. Can't upgrade those. We can upgrade our dark elixir drill, so why don't we go ahead and do that? Boom, you guys were telling me that I needed to do that. We've got all this gold that we're going to try and fill up before we get to Town Hall 8. I can't upgrade this air defense, uh, this air sweeper either. It is an air defense, but it's an air sweeper. Uh, so we're gonna have to wait 22 hours in order to do that, guys. The next thing that I need to upgrade that y'all are telling me is this. We don't have enough for that, but I will definitely, probably, definitely, probably, that kind of cancels itself out, have enough when we get back. Let's go ahead and watch some of these replays. So here's a really, really good one, guys. This was a great find. My goal in this at first was to drop off barbarians and take out the wizard towers, as you can see. Um, so we do that over here as well. I don't know why this wizard switches over to the archers when it was focused on the barbarians, but it ended up not killing them, so that's perfectly fine. Um, I never really understand that. If you guys know why they switch targets, um, I guess they killed the barbarian and then the archers were closer, so that's exactly why. Um, so we're heading in from all different sides right here. Our barbarians are doing what they're supposed to do, guys. This is why I love Barch. I love Barch so much. It trains up so fast. When we get done watching this and I get back, my army camps are going to be full of Barch, which is amazing. So we've already gotten a lot of loot from this. There's still some gold right here. We've got Elixir over the here. Everything is full. I'm finding so many Town Hall 7s down here. It's absolutely ridiculous how many Town Hall 7s there are that I'm able to just come and annihilate. Our archers, look at that. We've got a massive wave of archers surrounding everything. The mortar right here has no idea what it needs to focus on. It goes down practically <laughs> immediately once the king gets to it. Last thing, air sweeper, cannon, air defense over there. And it is a GG. Good going. We absolutely own that. Over 500, almost 500,000 in loot. 480. Um, and look, like I said, it's full. We're good to go. So we need to go ahead and attack. We need a lot of elixir to get this up. We're going to need 500,000. Like I said, I should be able to get that fairly soon. Let's go ahead and just remove some stuff now that we have all these builders available. And I'll be back with y'all once I find a base with a good amount of loot. Wow, guys, look at this. Woo! It looks like there's a good amount of elixir in the middle, but there's also a lot of gold around the outside. So we should be able to pretty easily take all this out, wait for that uh, giant bomb to blow up to deploy the rest of our troops. Go ahead, drop off our barbarians, make that wall. You guys know how to barge by now, super, super easy. I still love watching it because the loot is so freaking crazy. I mean, barge is ridiculous, it's so effective. Barge is, barge is love, barge is life. <laughs> I probably haven't said that in a very, very long time, but it is still very much true. Get out of here, yes I can deploy troops there. <laughs> Come on. All right, take out the rest of this elixir. We need to take out this gold right here. Take out this elixir over here. Are we in range? No, we're not in range of that wizard tower, but that mortar will definitely kill them. Thank you, mortar, for being a freaking jerk. Uh, can you, Ar archers, take him out. Archers, take out the king. Well, we got most of the gold, which is good. We've only gotten about 100. How much? How much have we? Why? The archers just, why are they still shooting that other thing? Come on. Why is he even a question mark above his head? <laughs> that was so ridiculous. All right, nice. And they're out of range of those mortars right now. As long as they don't move too close, they should be able to take out that other... Nice, look at that. Finishing off the rest of that elixir. There's still this elixir over here that we weren't able to get, and of course, whatever's in the middle. But 39%, 41%, just took out the town hall as well, so we can get that little bit of loot bonus. 255,000 gold, 230... Uh, I don't know. <laughs> 238,000 elixir on that one, guys. That's what I'm talking about. We've got so much gold. Um, I want to show you all a replay, though, of somebody trying to steal my gold and failing epically. I don't have walls, remember? Watch this. This guy's got a whole bunch of giants. He's got his clan castle. He's got his king. He's got his archers. 
I'm not too sure what he's doing right now. Uh, it's pretty clear there's no loot in the mines and pumps, or at least not that much. Like, there's not that much, because I just collected. So, uh, I'm interested to see where he drops off his, bar his uh, giants, because he's got 10 of them. And if he dropped them in down here at the bottom, he'd totally be able to get in here to this gold. Uh, it doesn't look like he had a full army army camp. Uh, what the heck am I saying? A full army comp? Uh, so maybe he's just going after the, the town hall, whatever it may be. Like, only 30 seconds left. There go the giants. Why, why would you drop off your giants at the end after all of your archers? This guy, I don't know if he's ever played before, Tavish. Um, if y'all are watching, you need to drop down your barbarians and your giants first because they tank for you. <laughs> they tank for you. Now he has nothing to get the gold. All right. Let's watch one more. Let's watch this guy come in with his archers and his goblins. Now, at this point, I did have uh, a lot in my mines and pumps. And he only attacks for like 30-something seconds. He's got a uh, level 2 king coming in, and his archers are just working their way around the base. Oh, my gosh. There go all the goblins. I thought I keep tapping it. Nope, I didn't. There go all the goblins down here. Our cannons don't know what to do, but the mortars are wrecking the goblins. Look at that. The mortars just own the goblins. He got an okay amount of loot. Not that much, though. So here's the thing, guys. In 22 hours... Oh, no. I need to train up more troops. In 22 hours, our Town Hall 8 is going to be done. We're going to have to make a video on that. I hope that y'all are stoked. I most definitely am. Thank you so much for watching. That's going to be it for this episode. We got to save up this gold. You guys, comment down below what you want me to upgrade first with my gold or what you want me to build with my gold. I can't see what comes with Town Hall 8 right now. Um, I could look it up, but I'll just wait 22 hours and figure it out. So let me know down below what y'all want me to spend my gold on because it's probably going to be full by the time we get there uh, and we're going to need we're gonna need to crush it. So thank you so much for watching, guys. Really do appreciate it. I love you all so much. You know that that's true. I'll see you guys in the next episode, all right? Later.